What is good, y'all? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video. Now, as you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail of today's video, we do have an installation to the car, man, a new mod to the car. We actually got a couple mods, but in today's video, we're going to be doing one of those mods. And I kind of already opened up the box to see, like, check on the condition and stuff like that. And with me saying that, you guys should already know what it is because I've said that multiple times on the channel with car parts that came in for Vader. It's a pretty big box, I'm not gonna lie. So let's go ahead and roll that intro and just get straight into this. Video. y'all some of y'all may have guessed it man yes sir we have a carbon fiber front splitter for vader in this box right here so like i said i already opened up the box because i wanted to check out the splitter and make sure everything was good and it was in good condition so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pull the box out kind of like here-ish because we actually gotta do something with some jb weld for two parts of the Splitter. So let me go ahead and pull this box out. I'll pull the carbon out and we'll get to it. Got that boy Geo pulling up, man. You dig? Yes, sir. In the Scatty Pack, y'all. All right, you guys. As y'all see, man, my boy Geo pulled up. Here we go. Big carbon fiber front splitter. Sheesh. Oh, my God. Joint's about to go crazy. So... What I was telling y'all, man, we got to use some JB Weld for the inlets. So I'm going to go ahead and start that process. All right, y'all. So I went ahead and pulled out the little inlets I was telling y'all about. So these, this is basically the ZL1 style side front splitter. So they're going to sit like right here. Ooh, that's just about to be so clean, bro. All right. <laughs> Yo, bro. Yeah, man. You know, you know my guy, bro. He's a good ass rapper, bro. Yeah, you feel me? Look at that. Look at that. Look at it in light. Quality. Look at it in light, man. It even sounds real. Facts, facts. So we got some JB Weld here, bro. We're gonna go ahead and clean the surface a little bit, and then we're gonna use the JB Weld, and hopefully they just hold. Supposedly, I think it says ten seconds, and then an hour to cure. So we'll see, bro. Many unbearable hours later. What is good, y'all, man? Jumping straight into this video almost three months later. It is finally time to install the front splitter on the car, man. So that being said, let's go ahead and start the car up. And get this joint up in the air. And get this OEM splitter off the car. All right, you guys. So as y'all can see, we finessed and got this carbon fiber front splitter in the car without dropping the seats because my baby girl's car seat is back there so that being said i'm gonna go ahead get this joint out unfortunately we're not going to be able to put on the winglets today just because we're waiting on the adhesive promoter um so that being said we're going to put on the main piece just because i can't wait any longer i want to see what it looks like and i still think it's going to look really good even though the winglets are not on so that being said y'all let's go ahead and get this out the car and get the OEM front splitter taken off. You guys got the car up in the air right now. So as you guys can see, we have a couple of eight millimeter bolts running through this entire front splitter. You're actually gonna use those same bolts on the new front splitter, um, along with some 3M tape to kind of have it stick and stay. So that being said, I'm gonna go ahead, undo these joints, get this splitter off, and I'll update you guys along the way. Uh, so boom, once you get all of the screws out, you do have about five rivets that you do have to drill out and then there is adhesive all through this splitter so you're literally gonna have to pry down on it to get it to drop as y'all can see adhesive right there so we're gonna take some time and get this joint off 
the next day. All right, you guys. So look, check me out, man. Unfortunately, unfortunately, I ran into yet another hurdle with installing this front splitter, bro. So as I showed you guys in the last clip, we had to get the rib nuts out, the rivets out, and we also had to get the adhesive off of the OEM 1LE front splitter. Well, little did I know, there were the five rivets along the splitter, but then there's also a rivet inside the fender liner <laughs> that you have to drill out as well, plus the adhesive. So I was doing this on my lunch break, trying to see, you know, if I'd be able to knock it out real quick. Literally, it's just the eight millimeter bolts and maybe some adhesive. At least I thought that's what it was, and that's definitely not what it was. Um, so with that being said, y'all, I'm actually not going to be able to finalize this install, but I've been sitting on this video for literally almost four months now, and I want to go ahead and get it out to you guys, bro. Um, literally, I, <sighs> oh, I've been trying my hardest to get this front splitter on the car, and it's literally a hurdle after a hurdle after a hurdle after a hurdle after a hurdle. First, the the inlets, the the winglets, they don't mount up from, you know what I'm saying, EOS. Then I was waiting on getting the splitter in stock from EOS in the first place for literally two years. Finally comes back in stock. I'm thinking, okay, it's just going to bolt right up to the car. Everything's going to be smooth. The winglets on the plastic version of this front splitter actually bolts up to the front splitter. So there's no using JB Well, there's no double size sticky tape, there's none of that. It's literally just bolts right to the car. So unfortunately, man, you know, these are the things that we gotta deal with when dealing with carbon fiber. Um, but with that being said, I am gonna be trying to knock this install out tomorrow after I get some of my work done at work. I'll probably go on lunch and try to knock it out. Hopefully, 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 bro. The next video you guys see, we've got the carbon fiber front splitter on the car and we can just, you know, enjoy how good the car looks. But with that being said, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. If you guys are new to the channel, please do your boy a favor, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a comment in the comment section down below. Give this video a big thumbs up if you're excited to see the front splitter on Vader. And I'm going to go ahead and roll that outro. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.